Yeah. He ain't even saying nothing. This nigga ain't even getting You got the camera on, nigga? Yeah, we got the camera oh, on, nigga. Shit. Damn, The nigga. people in TV land want to know what Sorry, the fuck people is you in TV doing. Land. You know, we what got a hundred and something fish to clean here and a nigga on, on, on production and, and, and an assembly line. So all I'm doing right now is taking the scales off these crappies so when crappie killer get here, we can start cleaning them. But the easiest way to take the scales off a of fish Scales Why don't you again. Get a close up on that? Scales up are me? what protect the fish from other, you know, other fish and parasites and things like that. So we got to take those things off because when we put these motherfuckers in that cornmeal jacket, we don't want to be eating scales. So again, I got a serrated knife right here. All I'm doing is just taking them across the crop like that, and the scales gonna pop off by themselves. That look like somebody ashy ass feet. That's look, that look like how some of you some of you ladies go to the nail shop and the agents got to do your feet like that. Yeah, that's the back of that heel. <laughs> that's that heel of y'all feet in them sandals. That husk. That <laughs> husk. <laughs> nigga, damn near all these kids back here, everybody belong to this nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everybody. Well, welcome back, Crappy. Crappy is not in the crappy mood this morning, nigga. I'm here to clean and get the fuck on. He's here to clean and get the fuck on. Get the fuck on, man. I don't like you not being in no good mood I'm with no big no ass knives, nigga. Morning, nigga. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't in the mood. <laughs> so you say the fork is faster than the knife? Faster, nigga. Look, we, about to show, we about to show this nigga how quick that was. Okay, let's go. <laughs> These niggas having a fish off to see who can scale the most fish. I think. I think Rippin' gonna cut his hand off with that big ass <laughs> knife, though. That nigga don't need a knife, he's using his hand to scale shit. <laughs> <laughs> Gorilla Nets. <mix. laughs> we already showed y'all how to take the scales off these fish, and the next thing we're gonna do is just show you how to do a real quick cleanup. You know, a lot of people don't know how to use a knife, and so the quickest way for us to clean a, cop, uh, a, a crappie is we just take the whole head off. And you just take a sharp, you want a sharp, sharp, sharp knife, and you start right behind this little fin right here. And then just press down a little bit easy. Go right through there. So the fillet knife will cut straight through the bone. Oh, it'll cut straight through the bone in the, 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 the head. If you got a sharp fillet knife, that's gonna cut through everything. If you got kids and you're trying to feed them without worrying about them bones, this is uh, how you fillet a crop. So what you want to do is come, usually the head is right there, so we would, we would come right behind the head and cut down right till you get to, to his backbone right there. So being that the head is already gone and I can see the backbone right there, I'm just going to put my fillet knife right here inside. And basically what I'm doing is taking this knife all the way back on the, on the uh, let the fillet knife rest on his rib, uh, on his backbone. And you take that knife all the way through, like so. I like to turn my fish this way and push the knife down, and then that's the that's your crop, crappie fillet right there. Here go the tiny little gristle bones that I was talking about right here. What I like to do with those is just get up under and slice those bones right out. Now you got a crappie fillet. If you want to do it without the skin, come right here. Come back on the on the ass end of his tail. Why you like, you like that ass? <laughs> <laughs> Again, press down with your knife like this and let it just rub. Oh, damn. Yeah. And break your motherfucking knife. Thanks, brother. Hey, brother. <laughs> it's supposed to be a fillet knife. It ain't supposed to pop like that. Here. But yeah. <laughs> you need a flexible knife to, to fillet crappie. You need a very thin, flexible, flexible knife because these fish meat is just about that thick, about a half an inch. So you're going back under it and just let that fillet knife go all the way across the skin. Now you have a crappie filet, no bones, ready to put a cornmeal jacket on that joint, and you can eat this just like a Lay's potato chip. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the end of the line? That thing right there. That out of all that head scale and everything else, that's, that's the piece of meat niggas is chasing. Pass. Just that meat right there, that's a boneless piece of crappie. All it need is a cornmeal jacket and some hot ass grease and a nigga to eat it. Bye yeah. Bye yeah. If I wasn't allergic to these motherfuckers, <laughs> I'd show y'all how to put them down your throat. But I ain't fucking with this shit. Fuck that. So and I'll come on the other there. side and show them on the other side too. This is what it's supposed to look like. Now if a nigga had a bunch of these, I can make me a crappie belt. 
That nigga start a new tree. Nigga, a crappie belt. That's how it's supposed to look, y'all. When y'all done fillet, filleting a crappie, it's supposed to just be his skin and all that meat on the other side is supposed to be in your mouth. The other side of the crappie is a little bit trickier because you didn't cut the other side off. So, again, it's starting down here where the bone is and going through his ass. You basically hold the crappie down like that, take the knife right through that motherfucker, like so. And they so small, man, that you could just, the knife go right through these motherfuckers. I like to turn the knife this way. Again, that's how your crappie can. filet is supposed to look. Your, your crappie is supposed to look like this. No meat on that motherfucker. Although I know some niggas that'll put this in some grease and eat through this motherfucker too. <laughs> <laughs> but he's supposed to look like that. And your filet, if you want to leave the skin on, I know some motherfuckers that like to leave the skin on. Here's a skin on filet. Like such. And the meat is on the other side. So we just gonna leave this motherfucker like this for somebody that's extra hungry. Like my black ass. Like hit, like West Red Diamond's black ass. Again, you go right through the rib cage on him. Take his rib cage out. That's how you take the crappie's bones out, right there. That's just his rib cage. Once you get that out, you got a crappie chip, because it ain't nothing that's gonna stop you. That's all meat, man. Put it down your mouth. <laughs> <laughs>